Nej, det er fair. Safe me. Bam, bam. That's, that's clean. Oh. Okay. 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 Why didn't they perform? Th this is hype. Oh. That's such a clean transition. I like it. This reminds me. Hello everyone, konnichiwa, minasan, hello everyone, it's Tony, so in continuation to our most recent video for JO1 being Shine a Light, Infinity, as well as OAO. We are now going to be looking at, as I promised, the performance reaction videos for Monster as well as Safety Zone. With regards to actually why I haven't actually looked at the Mama performance, I actually have. It's just that there were some copyright blocks in my channel actually has a strike because of one of them now so i'm being kind of like extra diligent and i'm having to remove that one in particular just because it does seem like mnet is going on a hunt for the people that have done a reaction for those but yeah that's besides the point i actually did kind of like make it up to you guys i hope by reacting to infinity shine a light as the official music videos now let's get into performance videos and i'm quite excited for these because you guys have been requesting these quite a bit so without further ado let's get into it we're going to start off with safety zone and then we're going to go into uh, monstar but there will definitely be timestamps if you want to go check out a specific one but i highly recommend that you check out both so without further ado let's get into it jinbi ready she check all right so let me know how you like this overlay i'm still debating on if i like this or if i prefer the other one that's kind of like this let me know though guys Ooh. a bit more suave guitar driven Ooh. Okay. Jazzy, sexy, nostalgic vibes. Retro vibes, actually. You're in danger, girl. Oh, I really like the song, too. It has like an upbeat brightness. The performance is really nice. It actually really shows great synchronicity elements. I'm still very, very impressed that even this song itself has influences of like almost a K-pop-y vibe to it. It reminds me a lot of like some other current boy groups that are performing that have a similar sound when it comes to this song in particular. It's very smooth, very suave, like. <laughs> oh, that synchronicity, that synchronicity was nice. Bam, bam. That's, that's clean. I like the use of the kind of like percussions like da na 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 but then they also have the underlying tone of like this bassy guitar that's like just continuously in there in the background that adds kind of like this smoothness, this calmness to the song. I like it. And they're kind of like adding like the smokier voices I find in the song which is really smart. They're really... That subtle tone flurry, okay. Very nice, uh, not what I was expecting, but very nice. Like still kind of keeping in the realm of J01 and like how, uh, J01 and what they've been doing with like all of their performances, like with their songs in particular, with a lot of like vocal flurries added in throughout. And it's kind of very pleasant to hear just having these nice high notes being reached. Oh, I know who I'm thinking about now. This kind of gives off like an older school, maybe EXO or like Monster X vibe. I'm maybe thinking a bit too much, but like that's kind of what the vibe I'm getting from, from this song. The synchronicity though. For Save. 
He really does look like Lee Dong Wook though. Like I, I mentioned this in my actual like perform like video reaction for the other music videos, but I find that he looks a lot like the actor. I think his name is Lee Dong Wook. I believe uh, from uh, Touch Your Heart, Goblin, and then most recently Nine Top Fox. I'm not sure if it's just me though who sees this. My safe. I like the rewind effect they just added. Okay. Smooth. All right. Hello. You like the danger? I find that like the deeper voice is being utilized. This really kind of like ref reference back to like K-pop songs. So I like the use of it. It's really smooth. And I do heavily think that like a K-pop influence could be heard. Like this, this group doesn't sound like a J-pop group in my opinion. This sounds more like a K-pop group. And that's like a, I think a compliment to them because I think they're really trying to like emulate a bit the system of like a K-pop group. This very dynamic choreo. Oh. Okay. Okay. Wait, you need. Save. It's so smooth. Like the the movements are so subtle, but they make so much sense, and they're just like sexy. Wow, that's really nice. Really nice. That was really cool. I I really like the choreo. Honestly, it's a kind of different. It doesn't feel kind of like super kind of intense like it usually is with like most like a just choreographed like performance videos. But that makes a lot of sense. I think in the sense of this song, just because. It's kind of a little bit slower, a bit more muted, a bit kind of like more soft and more kind of like focused on being like sexy. So like every move is even though like very slow or just like like very minute, it's kind of like has power behind it because it has that like sexy vibe to it a bit more of like the kind of just make every move kind of like make them fall in love with you type of vibe. It's a very very cool choreo and it definitely shows a different like range in terms of style of music as well of just their ability to actually do like really nice synchronized choreography together because we don't see that in the music videos so it's really nice really liked it so this is going this was safety zone and now we're going to look at monster which is their most recent release which is actually a few days ago all right let's go oh Oh, I like this opening beat. A bit more sentiment. I like the vibe of the outfit. Okay. Why didn't they perform? Th this is hype. One, I'm the one. The one, I'm the one. Oh. The bass in the background adds so much to it. It's like boom, and then like with the high note contrast, that's so nice. Oh, oh yo, having his voice come in now, it kind of feels like he's the evil villain, but it adds like a nice tone to it. Oh, like a flavor. Oh, the deep voice. Oh. Let's build it up. Oh. That's such a clean transition. I like it. This reminds me a lot of like Infinity vibes. Boom, 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 boom. Wow. Jeez. Oh, this song. 
This song hits so different from the other ones. I really wish that this was a performance song on Mamba. They, this song definitely deserves to be heard a lot more. Interesting. So the past two verses after they've done the chorus, they come to like actually a deeper voice, which is smart because of how everybody of uh, the, the chorus finishes with the, like the higher tone voices in like a high note. It's smart to finish off with a deeper voice to come into that. Uh, sorry, come into the with a deeper voice. And then we're going getting back to like the higher tones, the transition. This and you can even hear it in the song. Here, you can hear that there's like a transition. So there's so it starts off kind of like... The guitar that was in the background now kind of like has a higher kind of forefront beat now. It's being more prevalent once we have like this higher voice here. Their choreography, by the way, just from like literally this tense, this this like two seconds is so intricate. Like that in comparison to like literally what we just saw from Safety Zone shows a huge progression in a matter of months. Very, very impressive. It's so, so oh, love it. The monster on oh, the one of the one one of the one I'm the one of the one come on uh, I'm the the violin in this part Boom, 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 boom. I, I've said this again, but like JO1 has a special way with certain like beats that just kind of feel almost nostalgic in a way, but they kind of make them modernize because of they add like a pop element to it. But it's so well included that they always have like a bit of like almost a classical element, and I just love it. I love it because it just kind of hits nostalgic vibes for me. It feels so ethereal right here. I feel like he's like one of the main vocals because I've always heard him being one of the ones to hit more of like the high notes. Ooh, electric guitar. Oh, okay, blue hair vocalist. Too. Okay. It feels so sentimental here. Let's Oh, that's a cool mix up. Oh, the the choreo got so good. I'm on the one. The choreo got so good, so fast. Yo, if this is what happens in a matter of months for this group, I am. So hype to see what another full year of development will do for them. We got to remember that essentially took a year and a lot of these trainees aren't that great at dancing. A lot of them aren't good at singing. A lot of them just basically came off the street and be like, yo, I'm going to become an idol. And they made it, which is a very big congrats to them. And definitely you can see in their Mamba performance that there are very bright moments for their live performance and everything, but there is definitely room to grow. So seeing these performance videos really gives me a newfound appreciation for just how quickly of a developmental stage these guys have been ramping out. And I'm assuming how hard they've been working and it just really goes to show like in monster in particular just like how much talent these guys have how much like the potential they possibly have so i'm really curious to see what this next year holds for them what happens what unfolds and how well these guys are going to get how big these guys are going to get and i'm super super looking forward to it monster is probably one of my favorite songs in particular just listening to shine a light infinity oao and then also safety zone this song in particular just hits different i think it's the same thing with infinity those two songs really stand out for me 
and I'm really looking forward to what they have next. So hopefully you guys did enjoy this video. Hopefully you guys did watch my other video for J01 being the music videos. And if you haven't already, I'll leave it linked in the description box down below for you guys. Hopefully you guys do check it out. But with that being said, thank you so much for watching. Arigato gozaimashita. Kamsamnida. And with that being said, I'll see you in the next video. Annyeonghaseyo. Goodbye. Bye-bye.